ahead of the consumer price index to be released tonight, U.S. Treasury yield continued its recent uptrend on Monday, with 10-year U.S. Treasury yield rose 7 basis points to 2.79%. U.S. stocks suffered pressure on Monday, with all the S&P 500 index industry sub-index posting declines. In particular, energy and technology sectors suffered the most selling pressure. The three major U.S. stock index fell 1.2 to 2.2% yesterday, of which the last that index pulled the largest decline. Besides S&P 500 and Dow Jones index, also closed slightly below 50-day moving average. Besides U.S. dollar continuing to move higher, U.S. dollar's index test the major resistance again at 100. For the Hong Kong and Hong China stock market, CSRC launched a measure to stabilize capital market, including encouraging enterprises to increase dividend payout, increasing share buyback, and major shareholders to increase tax. Chinese regulators have approved the first batch of online games for monetization since July 2021, a sign showing that the regulatory control over internet platform has been moderate. Hong Kong stock is expected to stabilize today, however, with many negative factors, including China pandemic remain tough, as well as sharp rise in U.S. Treasury deal, short-term upside for Hong Kong stock is limited. Hessian that's initial support is estimated at 20-day moving average at 21,400 level. Hong Kong stock connect led info level to 68 million yesterday, led by concentrate on Meituan and CNOC, while less sell focus on premium value consumer stocks such as leading and China resources beer. Chinese regulators resume online game monetization approval, which will provide support to Tencent uh, today. Tencent share price initial support is estimated at 350. However, high uh, bond yield depends less debt. Together with Buffett's partner, Moringa reduced his holding on the Alibaba ADR. This is my limit short-term upside for Charlie internet platforms. For the stock pick today, we will recommend Charlie Bull Chemical, Fee Line A3, China Bull Chemical let profit double to 1.5 billion last year, fan to increase in the selling price of methylon and urea. And looking ahead in 2022, due to COVID pandemic and Ukraine Russia conflicts, urea price remain at high level. Despite retreat in methylon price recently on lockdowns, we see the price to rebound on its pandemic in the second quarter. Besides, China Bull Chemical also leverage on his parent company, CNOC, to control natural gas cost increase. The companies declare a uh, dif- file dividend and um, offer a dividend yield of 6.4%, providing downside cushion to investors. We suggest investors to buy with a target price at $3.6 and a stop price at $2.65.